Well, hello there, Suffies. Thanks for stopping by my part of the tube today. Um, as you can tell from the title, I'm going to be talking about a brush that I've fallen in love with that I've been using for the past, I'll say the past month and a half now. Um, so I'll just jump right into it and just get it started. So the brush I'm talking about is by Essential Tools. And it's called the Perfect Complexion. Well, not Perfect Complexion, but Smooth Coverage Brush. Um, I guess that's what it's called. Um, I got it from Walgreens. It was about $2 and... No, I want to say it was $3.86. And this is the brush. Oh, yeah. So it's called Smooth Coverage. And this is what it looks like. And yes, it's dirty because I used it today. So, I bought, like I said, price point. This brush was about $4. Yep, $4. And this is one of the best brushes I've had. It's soft. It's dense. It's such high quality. I'm going to have to insert pictures of the makeup I've used that this... Oh my God, y'all, you have no idea how good this brush is. And it's one of my favorite brush. Right now, it's actually my favorite brush. Um, I don't know, it's something about how it just gets in there and just makes that makeup do magic. Like right now, I'm wearing the Marc Jacobs Remarkable Foundation. And that's like a $55 foundation. And I'm putting it on with a... $4 brush. Yeah, that goes to show you how good that it works. Like, you don't need a million dollar brush to get good coverage. This brush does just as good as any of my other brushes. I, In my opinion, it works better than my Real Techniques brush. And it works damn for sure way better than my Sephora Dome Stippling brush. Like, I'm looking at this and you would think because it's Sephora... It's more um, mid, high-end type stuff. It would do better. Nope. This brush right here just blends my makeup so freaking good. You have no idea how much I've been using this brush. Like, I've been using this brush so much, I forgot I had these other brushes sitting over here. I don't need any other brush. So, basically, I've been using this brush to apply my makeup for the past month and a half. I've fallen in love with it and I've used it in pretty with pretty much every foundation I have. I think the only foundation I've not used it with is my um, Revlon Color Stay Cappuccino. Outside of that, um, I've used this with my Sephora. I've used it with the Marc Jacobs. I use it with the Black Opal. I used it with the MAC. I've used it with, uh, who else sitting over there? I use it with every foundation I have. I haven't used it with, well, no, I take that back. I had the um, Estee Lauder Double Wear. I hated that stuff. It just, the finish, like the brush did good, but the way it looked was just not, it was a d dark cast or something. I think it was just that makeup. But in general, this brush right here, if you're looking for a good backup brush whenever you don't have um, your main brush that you use, whatever brush that that is, go to Walmart, pick up this Essential Tools brush. It's called Smooth Coverage, and you will not be upset at all. It would be the best $4 investment you've made on a brush. I kid you not. So again, if you want to know what the package looked like, this is it. This is it. Go out there, pick up this brush, get it in. Like, get it in. I assure you, you will love this brush. So, I'm going to get out of here. My neck is hot. I'm tired. It was a long day at work. But someone did ask me what brush I've been using to apply my makeup. And I want to make sure I got this video out in a good enough time frame for them to watch it. So I want to thank you guys for watching. See you next time. And drop any questions below if you have them. Bye.